one of the coolest, if not the coolest use of trigonometry is measuring something that you can't actually reach. So let's say you have this height DC that you're trying to measure. And for some reason, you can't quite reach it. It's too tall and it's too far. Or there's a river in the middle. Or it's like, I don't know, there's lava. <laughs> you can't quite reach it. No problem. Here are three steps in which you can actually measure or calculate the height DC. One, measure the angle of elevation. Let's say you measure 45, for example. Then you move in a straight line towards or away from it. And let's say you move 12 meters. And then from that second point, you measure the angle of elevation. Now let's pretend that it's 55. So you're going to have an angle over here and an angle over there. You know that this is going to be 12 meters from A to B. Uh, but tell me something, two questions for you. Does the 45 go here at the B or does the 45 go here at the A? And the 55 was on the other side, obviously. So which one's that? Another question, how many triangles do you see in this problem? Check next video.